year 1764, a significant battle took place in the northern part of India that changed the course of history. The Battle of Buxa was fought between the East India Company and the combined forces of the Mughal Empire, the Nawab of Bengal, and the Nawab of Wat. The battle took place near the town of Buxa, which is located in present-day Bihar, India. The East India Company had a force of around 7,000 troops, while the Indian side had a much larger army of around 40,000 soldiers. However, the Indian forces were not well organized, and their troops consisted of soldiers from different regions, which made it difficult for them to work together effectively. The Indian side was led by Mir Qasim, the Nawab of Bengal, and Shah Alam II, the Mughal Emperor. They had joined forces to stop the East India Company from expanding their territory in India. On the other hand, the East India Company was led by Major Hector Munro, who was an experienced military commander. The battle began on October 22, 1764, and lasted for several hours. The Indian troops initially had the upper hand and managed to push back the East India Company's forces. However, the British troops were better trained and more disciplined, which allowed them to regroup and launch a counter-attack. The Indian forces were eventually defeated, and the battle ended in a decisive victory for the East India Company. The Battle of Buxa had far-reaching consequences for India. The defeat of the Indian forces paved the way for the East India Company to expand its control over large parts of India, including Bengal, Bihar, and Orissa. It also weakened the Mughal Empire's power and influence, which eventually led to its decline. Mir Qasim was forced to flee to Awad, where he sought refuge with the Nawab of Awad. In conclusion, the Battle of Buxa was a significant event in India's history, and its impact can still be felt today. It marked the beginning of the British Raj in India and paved the way for the colonization of the subcontinent. In the year 1764,